Good morning. I am switching from a Petunia Pickle Bottom boxy backpack, which you see right here. I have this completely fully packed, um, like we were going to spend a day out somewhere. We recently went to Boo at the Zoo. Malia is 19 months old, and Jillian is 13, and she also took another friend. And um, we packed this bag, and we all agreed that we hated it. We could not find anything in it. Um, everything, there's just not a lot of organizational pockets in it, and it was, it was a nightmare. Plus, I didn't have the stroller clips on my stroller in the basket. Um, once the bag was fully packed, was just jammed in there. The bottom came out of the, um, the stroller. <laughs> so anyways, yeah, it was pretty much a disaster. I mean, it was fine, but you know what I mean? It was a pain. So, I ordered a, um... Juju B B F F. So this video is to show you what I have in my Petunia Pickle Bottom, and then when I get the B F F, um, if that's any better. I had a B F F probably a year ago when Malia was little, and I really liked it. But you know how it is. I I just like diaper bags, and I like the looks of the Petunia Pickle Bottom. It's less like a diaper bag, um, more like a purse. I actually had. The white bowl um, petunia pickle bottom and sold it. And this is a pickle bottom I've had just in the middle of I've been using this till I figured out what other diaper bag I wanted to get. Okay, so anyways, here we go. Um, when this is completely packed, I cannot fit my water bottle or a sippy cup in the side. Okay, so here you go. You open it. It has Velcro on the front. The newer ones have... Um, magnets and then it has a top zip right here and then my favorite feature and I'm gonna miss on this is that this unzips to make a changing pad which I have in here a disposable pad and also um, the jujube um, little mini pad that I kinda lay down on this um, the new style, this thing that flips out will unhook so you can throw it in the washer. Okay, so what I have in here is a case that I made with wipes. And then I have um, one, two, three size, um, size, three size three diapers. We also um, cloth diaper, but she's had a rash that we can't get rid of, so temporarily we're doing this. Have two things of Desitin. Have a pad. I have the little baggies, and I have um, chapstick, and that's it in there. Okay, so then here's the problem. Once you get this fully packed, like we did, we didn't notice it so much when we were just using it as a day-to-day -day bag, but when we went somewhere for a whole day, it was just a nightmare. Um, just we had to just take everything out of the bag to get to what was needed on the bottom. Everything was getting mixed up. And in March, in a few months, we're going to be going um, for a week-long trip to Disney World. So we really want a bag that works well. Okay, so what I have in here are my keys. The lighting's terrible in here. Maybe if I turn. It's a really gloomy day out. I have my, um, my keys clipped to this. And then I have um, a snack cup, which normally would have something in it. I have my sunglass case on the top. As you can see, it's kind of, it's just all in here. In here I have this little case that has hair stuff in it. I have boogie wipes. I have a Planet Wise bag. I have this diaper duck, which needs refilled, but that's usually in there. And then on the, they have these bottle pockets on each side, which you can't see very well. And in this case, I have, hang on, let me set this down for a second. Okay. In that side bottle pocket, I have this. Um, this is a green sprouts. Um, a wipeable bib that completely covers them. Let me tell you, this thing is awesome. Green sprouts, love it. And then I have a, a little fork tucked in there. So that's usually in that side pocket there, if you can see. And then in the, oh, and then on down, these pockets are big on the sides. I have um, a first aid kit. 
think that's it on that side. On the other bottle pocket side, I have this little strawberry bag. And then I have a thing of apple juice on that side pocket, which that's it there. Okay. And then to keep it more organized, try, I have a little bag here that I keep like toys in. So here's a board book and a little ball toy. Okay. And then in this wet bag right here, I have all of our snacks. Just for the heck of it, I'll show you this in here. Dump it all out. In here we have yogurt melts, these new dip things, these biscuits. I hope we haven't tried these yet. We have these little fruit pouches. I think that's it. Yeah, that's all that's in here. Then we have an outfit. As you can see, I mean, I'm trying to be organized. There's just not any, you can't see it all. <laughs> it's pitch black. Um, I'm trying to be organized, but they're just, there's no way to be organized besides putting it in these bags. And then if you put it in bags, they don't fit. So there's my wallet. Wish you could see better. Wish I had a light. My camera broke. Okay. I'm going to stop this and figure out some better lighting. Okay, here's much better lighting. Okay, so now we're into the bottom of the bag. Let me turn this way. Okay, so down here I have the, the rest of her clothes. And in the bottom of here, which, there you go, I have my camera, which is broken, but I just put it in there so you can see everything I get in here. And a fingernail file, lotion, these squeaky little eggs. She loves that thing. I grab that if she's grouchy. And a little sticker. Sit down. Okay, so you can see. I mean, it holds a ton, but you just... Like what my daughter said was, she's like, Mom, the top of the bag doesn't open wide enough that you can't see what's in there. She said, I like the jujube that you had because it zipped open and you could see everything. Okay, so then there's this little side pocket. And I have a ton of stuff crammed in here. I'll pull it out just so you can see what I have in here and maybe how it'll be better packed in the jujube. Okay, hydrocortisone cream for itchy. This time of year you get bug bite, all that stuff. And it's also cold season. There's Jillian's, um, the 13-year-old, there's her cough drops. Here is a little mirror. Headphones. I always need headphones. I have fingernail clippers. I have a pen. Um, this really holds a lot. I have boogie wipes and I have um, earplugs. Those are always good to have. Hair clip. Another pad. Um, one of these EOS lip balms. And then hair ties and nail polish remover. And then I have these little tiny things. I don't know if you guys have ever gotten these, but they're awesome for your baby. Malia's 19 months old for little pigtails because she. Okay, so here you have it. I've emptied it. This is everything that was in there. I mean, it really is a lot of stuff. You know, so if you went somewhere for a day, you could get everything you needed in here. And then you can kind of distribute it through your stroller if you're a stroller user like I am. You know, I mean, I guess an option would be to take out some of these, I don't know, smaller bags and put them in the bottom of your stroller. You know, like maybe a bag with just diapering stuff. Um, I don't know. I mean, there's a way to make this bag work. You know, and I had the newer one thinking it would be better. The laminated kind that you could wipe that has more organizational pockets on it inside, which I don't have it. I wish I did, but, you know, you have to sell a diaper bag to get a new diaper bag. This one I didn't sell because it's so old. But let me tell you what the difference is. Like, on the new one, this little Velcro pocket here, um, it would tear off, you know, like, come off so you could have your stuff in it which was nice and it was bigger however it kind of bulked out and blocked like the what you would get in here and then the then the other difference is there's two pockets one here and one here that you could put stuff in but again you put stuff in those and then you couldn't get to the middle pocket so you'd have this full and this full and then couldn't get to the middle um and you, you have the two bottle pockets on the side which are super deep um, and then also 
on the outside of the other one, the, um, the bottle pockets were wider and taller, and they were awesome. They really were. Um, you know, I mean, I guess if this, you, you're getting this bag for just daily stuff where you don't need a ton of stuff in there, you can find stuff and get in here, and it really looks more like, um, just a nicer bag. The Jujube, where I like it, it's wipeable and all that, which, I mean, it's what I'm going to end up using because it's functional. I mean, it is a diaper bag, so it's going to look like a diaper bag, but this one just didn't quite look like a diaper bag. I guess I'm kind of vain like that, but anyways, all right, well, we'll see if this fits into the next one. I'll see you when the Jujube comes, waiting for it to be delivered from Amazon. Okay, this is my Petunia Pickle Bottom Boxy Backpack in the bottom basket of my um, Brytax B Agile Stroller. It takes up the entire basket. Well, there's some space in the back, but it just gets jammed in here, and you literally can't get it out. So I hooked up my stroller clips, and I'll show you it hooked up on the stroller clips so that you have the basket free. Okay, here it is on the stroller clips. Um, and then you can just get right into it, and then you still have your basket free on the bottom, which you can hardly see. Okay, the package has arrived. Let's open it. Here it is opened. Yay! Oh, it's gorgeous. I love it. I'm hoping that the backpack, because there's an older version and a new version, and yay, this is a new version where the back um, pack clips are at the top and not lower. Yay! On Amazon, you can't tell really which ones you're getting. Oh, look. Look, look, look. I'm so excited. Let's set them side by side. I think the BFF is bigger. Woohoo! Let's, let's get packing. Okay, guys, I forgot how beautiful these bags are. This bag is really big compared to this other one. Um, oh, my gosh, it's absolutely gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous bag. Love this print. Okay, here it is with everything opened. Like, the inside of this is so pretty. Oh, my gosh. And I love how it opens up really wide so you can see everything that's in your bag. Like here, let me compare for you. Here's this one and how it opens. I'm not doing a very good job with one hand. And then here's this how it opens. So see if you can compare. You can see huge difference. Like, wish I could hold it down. See there, there's that view, then this view. Here's the mommy pocket. There's a pocket here, and then there's, um, here's the backpack straps, which are really padded and nice, and then here's the memory foam changing pad, which is gorgeous, and I have the other one, the, um, it's a lighter version, which these will work really well, because this one's not going to be big enough, so we can use both to make it fit my long toddler. Then you've got these huge bottle pockets on the side. Look at my arm goes clear down in there. Oh, it's gorgeous. Love it. All right, let's see if all this stuff will go in there. Okay, guys, I just wanted to show you that I've probably seriously taken half of this stuff and just put it in the mommy pocket. Um, and, I mean, this mommy pocket is full which normally if you fill a pocket up in another diaper bag, it takes away from the other pockets. Well, this isn't the case because this pocket folds out. It comes out when you open it. So you still have all this space in here. Like, this is completely amazing. I, oh my gosh, I'm in love already. Um, okay, so there's that. Okay, here you have it, guys. I took everything that was in the um, other diaper bag and put it in this one. I mean, it's it's packed full. 
Um, but you know what? I don't even care anymore. I have everything I need in there, and I can find it when I need it. It's amazing how much more organized um, this bag is compared to the other one. I didn't think it would matter, but it really does. And then these three bags that I had stuff in to keep it organized, I don't even need those because everything I had went into a pocket that was already in the Jujube BFF system. Um, the only thing I don't have is the sip cup that would go in there, but it would fit. Totally would fit. Okay, so I'm going to go through and pull out everything that, um, how I packed it in this one and where I put everything. So you can compare the two. And before I do that, I'm going to hook this up to my stroller and show you what it looks like on the stroller and if it'll fit in the basket, which I'm sure it's not going to fit in the basket. But, um, okay, here we go. Okay, here's my Juju B BFF on the back of my um, Brytax um, B Agile stroller. Um, it's really nice on here. I've got it on stroller clips, but they're petunia pickle bottom stroller clips. But anyways, there it is, and I'll we'll see what it looks like open. Okay, here it is, completely unzipped on the back of it, which is awesome. It's gusseted, and you could seriously. I mean, walk around with it like that if you weren't worried about someone taking something out of it. I mean, my wallet's in the front of it. Um, but this is, this is really awesome. You can see everything in there. Here it is on the back of my stroller with um, the mommy pocket open to get into my sunglasses, my wallet, first aid kit, all that stuff right there, which that's pretty cool. It looks really nice on my stroller, too. I have a black stroller. Very pretty. I have a feeling it's not going to fit in the bottom of the basket at all. But let's see. Okay, the jujube will not even go into the bottom basket, which it's okay. You can hang it from the um, the stroller clips, which it just makes it easier. And then you can throw jackets or other bags or whatever you want in the bottom of the stroller. And it doesn't mess with the functionality of the stroller either. It can still be reclined without any problem, and I can still get to my drinks. Yeah, it's a big bag. It's awesome, though. Okay, here we go. This is how I've got everything in here. This stuff I didn't need. My sunglass case, I opted not to do the pen because it kept opening. I didn't want it to write in there. Okay, so this is how I have it packed. In the mommy pocket, I have my keys clipped to the key fob. And then I have my... Sorry, you guys can't see. My sunglasses in the sunglass pouch. Here is my wallet, which I ordered to be thrifty, which is smaller and more compact. And I'm not going to get it in a pink color because when everything's pink, you can't find anything. Um, then in the bottom of this pocket, I have my file and my hydrocortisone cream and my chapstick. In the front pocket, I have my chapstick and my um, first aid kit. That's it down there. That's it in the bottom. In this little pocket here, I have my lotion and my mirror. That's it. And then in this little pocket, I have my, um, I'm not going to take this out, my makeup, or not makeup remover, my, um, it's remover. And then I have pads, clippers, um, and that's it. Oh, and my little um, earplugs. Then... So that's it for that front pocket. Then in this pocket, which is black and you can't see anything, I have my camera and I have the earbuds. Okay. Then in this pocket, in this section, in this front pocket, I have the boogie wipes and cough drops and little packs of boogie wipes. It's cold season. Then in this section, on top where I can get to them easy, I have snacks, snacks. In this bag, I put her outfit. Then here's my diaper duck, my little bag, the book, the little snack pouch. I have the juice and the toys. Then in the side pockets, then in the side pockets, I put the bib that I had. And on the other side, I put the two fruities down in there. I think that's it. Oh, nope, and the spoon. That doesn't, you don't need a spoon for that, but it's in there that way. Then these back pockets, I have the wipes case that I made, and then the little snack dipper thing. 
that's it in there. And then this back pocket, which is so deep, my, I don't know if you can see it, it goes clear down to my wrist. I have all the hair stuff, which I'm not going to take out. And then in this pocket on the right, I just have a sticker, nothing in there. So there's that. On the side, I have my water bottle, which fits amazingly. Okay, and then I decided to put all of my diapering stuff in the back pocket. So it's all in one place. So when I get where I'm going, I just pull it out. I'm going to do it with one hand. And I have the diapers wrapped up in here. So there's the pad with the bee light. And then the three diapers. All of this is in this back pocket. And then I have the little plastic bags and the desitin. So that's all in the back. I think that's everything. That's how I packed it. I got all that stuff in here. I mean, you guys can be the judge, but I really like this one a lot better. It's a little bit more bulky. It won't fit in the bottom of my stroller, but it works on the stroller clips and everything's organized. I know everybody gets like the little bags to put everything in, but um, think about this though. You, If you use it all the time, that's fine. And you memorize where they're at. But if there's someone else getting in your diaper bag, like Jillian's 13 and her friend, they don't know where everything is in there. So I like to have them visible, pretty much. You know, the main things that they're going to get in there and get out, like snacks or diapers, so they can look in there and kind of see. Or I can just kind of say, this pocket, not this bag. Um, I mean, an alternative to that would be the see-through bags, but... Okay, there you guys go, and maybe I'll put a clip of trick-or-treating tonight with um, all this in action. Thanks for watching. Oh, and if you have any questions at all, um, leave them below. Okay, I also wanted to show you another option. I have these this huge water bottle, and I filled it up and set it inside, and then here's my other water bottle. This is for trick-or-treating. Um, so we have plenty of water because we're going to be walking for a couple hours and everyone gets thirsty. It's going to be 80 degrees here, which um, is pretty warm. But anyways, just wanted to show you that that fits in there. And I just took the, um, the outfit of clothes out, which gave me more room in there, which I'll just leave that bag in, inside the truck while we're trick-or-treating. You going to dance, Malia? <sighs> we're going to go trick-or-treating. All right, we stopped at a little cafe. We're at a little cafe, aren't we? 